Hey, it's me, Storm the Bean, and welcome back to some more Project Ozone Light. Yes, I know I keep playing this. Um, it's because the only other uh, pack that I'm playing at the moment is um, uh, Space Astronomy, and I'm doing that just on live streams with uh, with Big Daddy J. So. Um, yeah, you should come check those out if you're able to. Uh, I usually do like a live stream every other day, so feel free to come and have a look and uh, see what we're getting up to. But, uh, guys, if you are still enjoying this series, then please do hit that like button down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, then please do subscribe for daily Minecraft videos. Please do tell all your friends about the channel and uh, do all that great stuff. And if you want to come and join the server, then all you have to do is head on over to Patreon. The link is in the description down below. And, um, yeah, you two could uh, could come and, and play with uh, uh, all these guys. There you go. Uh, so we've got Jamass252, Ozzytron15, uh, JLW1808, Basmanium Devil, and Brigham. Uh, so yeah, so you can come, uh, come and uh, play with all these guys and all the other ones, and Jay and, and Ant and, and, and all those. Yeah. Uh, anyway, um, let's get on with today's episode. So I have been doing a little bit of work off camera. I will show you uh, where I have got so far. I want to do... Um, most of it on camera um so let me just because i forgot to put that back uh let me just put this back here um whoa 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 whoa, whoa. don't don't do this to me right so i have now made it so that all of my uh sieves or sieves whatever you want to call them are uh, in the largest configuration you can do um which is i think nine by nine right so that's one two three four five six seven eight nine yeah and it's nine that way as well uh so this is set to activate block with item right click and that will start auto sifting for me uh let me show you it in action if i have anything that i can sift um, uh, i've got these two That'll do. Um, it, it's going to go rather quick, but there you go. That's um, there you go. There's one over there. <laughs> I don't know where the other guy is, but that is being sifted right now, and um, this will get picked up. Thank you very much to uh, Bifta uh, by this guy, the Advanced Item Collector. Now I've got this set to a radius of ten. I'm not quite sure how you set this out. I'm assuming you take the the X Y Z over there and and whatever. Uh, it does its thing, uh, but it does pick up uh, everything that you need it to, and it also picks up randomly at the moment uh, anything that is in that 10 um, radius, so uh, it will do that automatically. Let me just go and grab this, because redstone is a problem for us at the moment still, uh, but hopefully uh, we'll be able to remedy redstone pretty soon. We're not doing too bad, I suppose. Uh, but yes, anyway, so uh, that is an advanced item collector uh, from Random Things. Uh, thank you so much, Bifter. That has really saved me a lot of trouble because the absorption hoppers kept breaking for some reason. I don't know why. Um, but this is sifting automatically for me at the moment, kind of. Then... We move on to the mechanical crafter. We have a uh, item conduit with an extract and a basic item filter, filtering iron ore pieces straight into the mechanical crafter. Please, server, don't play me up. The mechanical auto crafter or mechanical crafter, whatever you want to call it, takes the iron ore pieces, turns them into iron ore, and then that is automatically transported over here to the smeltery via the uh the cabling that i have going on under here ignore that one i need to remove it but there we go so that is doing its thing there so i'm automatically receiving iron because iron i find i am using a lot at the moment and um and that's why i'm doing it why am i waiting for server there we go so we've got a fair amount of iron uh power wise up there is still going great uh it's whoa uh it is keeping all of this filled up um, and it's doing a fantastic job. In actual fact, let's just put that in there and get that charging while we can. Um, I'm trying to fly here. <laughs> um, other than that, I haven't really done anything else. I need a storage system. Um, that's really, really important to me right now. I need a storage system so bad. But I just, I don't have the materials to do it just yet. But um, we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. What is all of this doing here? That can actually go into a, um, a compacting drawer. Or a, not a compacting drawer, but one of these guys. Is, is that full already? No, nope, there we go. 355. Right, let's go and grab 
uh, my stuff back. Yeah, I'm experiencing the lag also. Um, okay, so let's put that back on, which means I can fly. Uh, so it leads me on to the fact that I've expanded the base. And because I've expanded the base, I really do need to claim a few more chunks. Let that just load in. So there we go, like so. And we're going to chunk load it all because I'm OP and I can uh, load 64 chunks. And, well... I'm allowed. Right, so here I have a complete cow setup ready for today for us to get auto uh, smelting and, and mining or storing. Uh, so we have the blazing pyrothium. Uh, apparently we can use that as a fuel and maybe turn that into some sort of energy. Uh, next we have molten signalum. That was a pretty cool find. Uh, I'm really happy with that one. Uh, we have the cobalt cow that we've seen before. The nutrient distillation is for when we get the inventory screen, I think it's called. Uh, liquefactor coal, you've seen before, um, I was using it over there, but I've moved it over here now. Uh, we've got witch water, which I thought was quite nice. Molten copper, pretty standard. Liquid lithium, I feel like I might need that, I'm not sure. And, uh, and then we have molten emerald. And uh, do we have any more with this guy's new? Who are you? Uh, jelly cryothium. How cool is that? So we have the hottest material and the coldest material. You, you would have to run away, pig. You knew I was going to kill you. Uh, we've got rocket fuel. Uh, I've got the energized glowstone from last time. Not really using him. Refined glowstone. Vapor of levity. See you later, buddy. There you are. Die. Um, uh, I'm keeping the wolf because I'm going to make him a pet. Uh, but my favourite, most favourite one that I've got so far... What is this one? Energised Glowstone. Um, and I've got him right here. This one I cannot believe I got. Molten Supremium. I really can't believe that that spawned and um, I have Supremium for free. So that means I can uh, I can get on with like some of the later game armor and stuff like that, which is pretty pretty awesome. Uh, anyway, so now we've done that and that's out of the way. Uh, let's get on with um, uh, trying to get these things set up. I really do need to sort out my storage systems. I'm so sorry to anybody watching and um, and thinking. That is disgusting. That really annoys me. I'm so sorry. I do apologize. Right. So, uh, what we need to do is, uh, if we take uh, one more of those, there we go. We're going to need to make ourselves a mechanical user. That's a definite. So, let's, uh, let's get ourselves four redstone ingots. Um, because I want to get this supremium stocked up. Uh, also, I'm going to need some sand. Do I have... Do, 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 do I have that? I had... I may have smelted it all down now, thinking about it. I have these, so I need one of you. Um, okay, let's get... Let's get this cobblestone turning into... Into gravel, and then gravel into sand. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's put that in there. there. Wow! I only just picked this up. I only just picked this up from downstairs. How cool is this? That is nice. That is not. I'm very, very happy with this. That is awesome. Okay, let's leave that running. That shouldn't take too long. Um, okay, let's put what sand we have into here because we're going to need some glass. And let's go and see if our ingots are ready. I may actually move that out of the sag mill and put that into here because that that's pretty fast. That is pretty fast. Okay, so if we do, uh, was it was it this? Nope. Was it uh, this, and this, and then this? No. This? No. I, I really can't remember the, the recipe for... <laughs> okay, let's just do a uh, user. Mechanical user, there we go. Uh, I want one of those. Um, short one ingot. Uh, I think I have uh, over here one spare. These Endermen are really, really starting to get on my nerves now. They really, really are annoying me. So I have that. Yes, I do have one spare. And I have the dropper. Look at that. Wow, where did you go? You went into there. That thing is awesome, but quite annoying. Um, 
Okay, so put that there, that gets me you, and then if I do that, that gets me you. Excellent. Um, okay, so we've got the four there. I should have some more, uh, which I can smell. If somebody said, um, turn... <laughs> this is fantastic. This is amazing. There we go, that's enough. That's all I need right now. Uh, somebody said turn the... Um, uh, turn the the diamond furnace into an emerald furnace because it's even faster. I will do that in a moment. Um, in actual fact, let's do it now. Let's do it now. Um, uh, if I take this and then just pull all of these guys out and just do that. Whoops. Okay, that was an accident. Uh, if I take eight of these, apparently, I don't know whether this is this is real or not. Good, good, good. Didn't know that, that was a thing. Uh, so if I do that, I make an emerald. Okay, slightly faster. I'll take it. Um, so if I put you down now and you there, and apparently it's more fuel efficient as well. Apparently so. Uh, okay, so where was I? I was I was looking in here to see if I got any more of this glass. Yes, I do. And then if I use my chisel. Uh, like so, I can get some more of that glass, and then I can go set this up. Dude, I mean, don't waste your breath. <laughs> I'm really fed up with all the Endermen, they're just everywhere. Um, so, let's put this guy down. Uh, oh no, I didn't mean to do that. So we've got to move this torch, there we go. And if we do this, like so. This this is kind of my my just my setup for uh, cows. I didn't really know how to do it, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to put something across the top. Undecided yet what I'm going to put across the top. I think I'm going to use some sort of factory block, maybe I don't know. Uh, but there we go. We can put our supremium cow in there now um, and get that ready to be uh, milked at some point. Um, okay, this get rid of you because I don't really want milk at all. Vapor of Levity, Gelid Cryotheum, come to me. Thank you, what you got here? Rocket Fuel, Vapor of Levity, uh, we've checked that guy out, uh, we've got the Refined Glowstone, Dew of the Void, anything else? See you later, dude. Uh, anything and normal cow again. Uh, this is really cool, I've been on here for about, I don't know, I want to say an hour, and um, I've got quite a lot of new stuff coming through. It's It's been pretty fantastic. So, uh, now that we've got this set up, I'm going to need to make quite a few tanks. Um, because I need to be able to put the fluid into one of the Ender.io tanks. And um, can we do that? Yeah, thank you. Um, so with that, I'm going to need uh, quite a lot of these. So let's do that. That gets me... A few of you, and then we have yeah the glasses here. Um, and does it take iron for an Ender IO tank? I cannot remember Ender IO uh, tank. Please, please, please. Oh, what is that? Hardened Enderium glass. That looks nice. Uh, I think it's just easier to type tank, isn't it? There we go, and we'll just take these, and it's going to cost me some more of you, so let's just do that, and that, that'll get me 17, that's more than enough uh, for what I need, um, and if we grab ourselves, we've got a couple of buckets here, we've got another spare tank here, which hopefully, not painted, not painted, but it's configured, okay, um, do we have the item conduit? Uh, we've got 17 of you. Uh, the other thing I'm going to need is, there's another bucket. Uh, I've got nine of those. I'm going to need a lot of paper. And I know I've got all of that for sure. Um, let me just check. I've got 37 here. Um, yeah, I think that's going to be enough. Uh, we'll take these. Oh, no, we don't need these. We can put those in there. Um, hmm. I 
think that will be enough. So if we type in up here filter, there we go, and we want to make 10, we'll do. I think that's how many cows I've actually got is 10, so um, what we got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so uh, we're doing this pretty much just how we set up the last one. It is literally uh, one cable uh, going straight into the tank. Um, like so. There we go. Done. Okay, and uh, we're going to place one bucket. Uh, we're going to need ten buckets, actually. So let's go. Yeah, let's go and grab ten buckets and make all these. There we go. We'll make that many. That'll do. Um, Nineteen is fine. <laughs> it's, it may be overkill. But 19 is fine. Um, and then we're going to want to say, after placing one bucket in, which it should hopefully... Oh. Uh, uh, use item on block? No. Uh, entity, I think. And left click? I'm pretty sure that's how I had it set, as entity and then left click so we'll find out oh no 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 right click right click please don't kill that cow whatever you do i can't remember what button do you use to oh 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 i can't for the life of me remember now Sure, it was entity. Milk the entity. Right click. Oh no, we don't want to put seventeen in there. Oh, upper, upper left slot only, maybe. I, I kind of gave him some breathing. Let me try it on these guys because I know I had it working on here so uh, entity yeah there we go it's entity right click and upper left slot only so my problem is I need to push these further back so um, okay okay let's uh, let's, let's, let's work this out so if we place this oh what's that Molten Night Slime, very nice, very nice. We've got quite a few. Uh, leather, de, be, be, be. Rocket Fuel, Lava, Gelid Cryotheum, again. We have two of these guys. Okay, so we need to get this set up. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go along. I'm going to make these so they're one block because quite clearly um, uh, these cows cannot work from uh, a two block radius it needs to be one so hopefully we should see su su Supremium in there yes we can okay so I'll just go around I'll go and change all this so it works for one block only uh, except for these guys and um, yeah I'll come back to you so give me a few minutes and I'll be back shortly okay so after a really 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 long time um, I finally managed to get it all automated. Um, I've put this on the roof. I'm going to, I'm going to do this now. Actually, there are just Endermen everywhere. I mean, why? What? What is the need for this? What is? What is the purpose of having all these Endermen? Why? It, it's just, it's annoying. I mean, is there any need whatsoever? Ever, ever, ever is what I meant to say. Not ever. I don't. I always do this to myself. Um, okay, right, we got some gravel. Let's, uh, let's throw that into there. Uh, may as well get that working for me. I just found that. So, yeah, there you go. Look at that. It does uh, almost a stack. Almost. Um, okay, so... Do, 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 do. I've taken a staff of travelling and charged it up because that's an easier way to get around. I just need a few torches to light up the top of my base there and yes I am using chisel to its fullest 
Did we get any diamonds? Because I just used a couple. No, we did not. But never mind. Uh, right, we got five there. And we should have... Yeah, there we go. A few more. Cool. Um, we should have iron going into here now. Yes, we have from all that gravel that I just placed out. Seriously? Did I... I thought I killed this guy. Uh, right, let's just put... Um, oh, I didn't really do that even, did I? Never mind. Um, let's just put that like so, and like so, and like so, and like so, and like so. There we go. Right, so uh, here we have the the fluids mounting up. So we have uh, nine buckets of Supremium already, uh, nine buckets of Emeralds, and eight buckets of Liquid Lithium, multi Copper... We got the witch water, 7,000, liquefacted coal, nutrient distillation, molten cobalt, molten signalum, and blazing pyrothium. Uh, what I want to do is I want to set these up so they go into barrels so I can do a bit better storage. I'll take that enderman head. Thank you very much. Might as well pick that bad boy up. And then we're going to look at these guys. Not that I want to be opening them. But we're going to look at these. These all came from uh, downstairs, uh, most of them. And most of them have come from... Okay, a few of them come from downstairs. But most of them come from killing the Endermen around the base. I have an artifact loot bag. Um, so I would like to uh, find out what we're going to get from that. Let me just do this. And... Hmm. I've got Endermen heads everywhere. Uh, there we go. We've got two there. So let's put that down. And I might make those uh, turn into good use at some point. Ooh, did I just cook some coal? Please, please. Don't cook the coal. What am I doing? Okay, so let's just head downstairs. Just see if there's any more loot bags being collected. Um, I should be able to just drop and be okay. Yeah, I am. Um, so we do have some mobs in here, but nothing special. We've got a couple here. Sorry, dude. Uh, I do need to set this up so that I can uh, start collecting more stuff. Let's, uh, we'll take that because we can smelt that down into iron. Iron's going to be needed quite a lot today, I feel. Uh, any more? That's iron, that's iron, that's iron. All oh, those are iron. Might as well use them while I can. Uh, anything else? Mm, no. Okay. Um, so yeah, so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to make myself some drums and I want all of the liquids to automatically go into the drums. Now I'm hoping I can use the push-pull uh, feature um, on the on, on the, uh, the, the uh, barrel uh, uh, tanks that I've already got. Um, but if I can't then it, it doesn't matter. It's, it's not the end of the world. Uh, so let's throw those into there and let's go and grab an absolute ton of iron. So I've got 910 at the moment. Not a great deal. Uh, I need 10 barrels uh, to do this. So let's. Um, uh, it's called a drum, isn't it? D R U M. Uh, so we have the iron drum. The reinforced is too expensive for me at the moment. And there's a stone drum? Huh. I would like the reinforced. But I'm not going to get there. So let's make uh, 10 of you. There we go. This is a lot of iron. Uh, we're going to want 20 of you. You can see why I'm using all my iron to try and um, try and do this. And then I'm going to want 10 of you, uh, which means that I can place the rest of you into there. And hopefully... Uh, I can do this because once I can get this into a drum, I will have 16 buckets in there. Plus, uh, do these hold? How much do these? I wanted to say 256 buckets, but it's not that much. I don't feel like it's that much. So, if I click on you and then configure IO and set you to push, yes, look at that. Signalum in the tank. Uh, so I should be able to do the same with you. Um, configure you to push. There we go. So emeralds, we're good for. This stuff, don't even know what this is going to be used for. I looked at it earlier to try and figure it out. It's something to do with mechanism. I think it can come in handy. 
I'm hoping. Uh, tank molten copper. Only one bucket. Why is that? Have I... Always active. Uh, so we've got... Ah, okay. So that's just set to extract. Oh, I totally messed up there. Totally messed up there. Um, so... I just need to put the filter in, yes? Yes. Or will it work now? It appears to be working, but I'd like to check. Uh, but anyway, let's, let's do this. So that will push copper into there. There we go. And I'm definitely going to install some sound mufflers underneath. Definitely. That is something that needs to be done, for sure. Yeah, push. That's what. Did I did I set that one to push pull? Yeah, push, right, good. Uh, so this is going to be handy, um, and there's something I wanted to test, and that was to see whether I can grab a bucket of this and turn it into some power some way. But I think I'm going to have to save that for next episode uh, because. Uh, I am slowly running out of time. So slowly running out of time. I'm massively running out of time. Uh, push that signalum. Uh, signalum from uh, most Project Ozones were was was pretty cool. Um, I'll check it out and see. But I think uh, that's going to be a handy thing to have. But there we go. Um, how much of this have we got? We we've, we've got eleven buckets of uh, Supremium already. How cool is that? Uh, but guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it there for now. Um, if you did enjoy, uh, please do hit that like button down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, then please do subscribe for daily Minecraft videos. Please do tell all your friends about the channel and do all that great stuff because it really does help out a lot. Um, I just want to say thank you very much um, uh, for all the support lately. It really has been fantastic. And um, yeah, yeah, please come back for the next one. Um, we, we should be looking at automating sifting and um, probably adding more storage drawers probably we'll see uh, but anyway guys thanks so much for watching I've been Stomp the Bean this has been Project Ozone Light good